the Federal Trade Commission stops deceptive credit repair organization who used ID theft affidavits to try to repair people's credit. Hi, this is Consumer Protection Attorney Bill Clanton. I've helped hundreds of people deal with inaccurate credit reporting, bad background checks, debt collection harassment, and all sorts of other consumer-related matters. And one of the topics that comes up occasionally is credit repair organizations. Lots of folks uh, like to go to credit repair organizations to help repair their credit, but this is not without risks. And this is a, a, a case that shows why. Now, the federal government sued Alex Miller, um, who had a uh, credit repair organization named Turbo Solutions, which does business as Alex Miller Credit Repair. And um, what Alex Miller was doing was promising people that he could raise their score by 50 to 200 points. He was charging them an upfront fee of $1,500 and offering to... Uh, Give, sell people credit boosting products, which doesn't really make sense. Um, and then, in most cases, he would fill out a fake ID theft affidavit with most of his customers not even knowing about it and submit those fake ID theft forms to the credit bureaus to try to get them to remove the negative items. It was this whole strategy, lying, using these fake affidavits to, to lie to the bureaus to get negative information removed. Now, and he got sued. He got sued for doing this and got enjoined from, from doing it. Um, now, this violates the Credit Repair Organization Act, CROA, CROA. Um, the Credit Repair Organization Act, and, and this, be on the lookout. If you are looking to hire a credit repair organization, I, I it's not always a good idea, but for some folks, it, it's the right fit. Um, you cannot be required to pay an upfront fee. In fact, uh, CROA says that you, the credit repair organization can only accept a fee after providing you um, the, their services. So a lot, what you'll see a lot of times is the, these credit repair organizations will sell you a course or a set of forms, something like that. And then, um, then after you, they get an item removed, they'll charge you a fee because they've completed their service at that point. Um, that is a more legitimate way to operate a credit repair business, but charging an upfront, upfront fee for credit repair services is a plain violation of CROA. And there also has to be disclosures about how to terminate the service um, and um, uh, certain other things in there uh, for CROA. But anyways, be careful who you hire. If you do decide to use a credit repair service, be very careful about who you hire because there are plenty of scammers out there. And this guy, Alex Miller, is just one of them who got caught. All right. Thanks for watching this video, guys. Uh, please like it, subscribe. Uh, we get the word out to more folks and get them the information they need. Thanks for watching.